Let's talk about Jesus and do our makeup. Okay. <laughs> we are gonna touch up my makeup and talk about Jesus. Y'all, I got my eyebrows and nails done. I am a claws girly. I normally like the clickety clack of the claws. However, these short dark nails are, they're, it's giving dark red wine red. Speaking of wine, Jesus. Hello, hello, shout out to Natalie. She posted on her story about this thing called the Bible Recap with Tara Lee Cobble. It is on the Bible app. It is chronological Bible reading plan. Let me tell you something. We have gotten out of the book of Job. Job is one strong man. It might be one of my favorites in the Bible, to be honest. I know different parts of the Bible speak to you at different seasons of life. Right now, Job is, that's my guy. Job shows us that it's possible to be human and still be considered righteous by God. Wait, okay, wait, actually, I'm gonna get my notes, hold on. So I got my iPad charging. One thing, ooh, satisfying. so satisfying. Job shows us that it's possible for righteousness and humanity to coexist. How cool is that? Super cool. We're just gonna, God saw the righteous in Job's human and he called it out, which is beautiful. He sees more in us than we see in ourselves sometimes, even at our worst moments. God is cool. God is so cool. <laughs> okay, we have to change locations because my life went out. I love that sound. The other thing about Job that was very profound in my spirit is a greater realization of God's sovereignty and how much comfort that God's sovereignty brings. It just brings me so much peace. In that peace, I've grown patient as well in the things that I'm asking God for. Like, I can't get over a good glow. What was I saying? The peace that comes. Instead of why, you just go into worship. Oh, she's shining. Shining, shining. Job is honest. She has a habit of sacrifice and prayer to God. We see he very much knows who he is in Christ and he's not easily swayed by the opinions of other people, even in a trial. Okay, the lippy is complete, baby. It is, ooh. Job asks a lot of why, why, why questions and it, God responds with just how expansive he is in the middle of something that's really, really difficult. We can tend to just hang our head and look down and focus on what's wrong instead of looking up and focusing on everything that's right with God. I'm having a great time in this Bible. God is really cool. He's actually very cool. The key is looking for God and not looking for yourself in every little thing in the Bible. Once you start looking for God in it and his character and just learning about who he is and how he moves in different situations with different imperfect people, that is, ugh. I'm having a ball. I'm having a blast. Makeup is done. She's looking glowy and stuff and things. So, I think that's it. It's hard not to be ashy out here, but subtle snatch. It's time to go run some errands. So, 